Hello students, welcome to online lecture series of discrete mathematics. Now in previous sessions, sessions we have already studied what is this complete graph, what is a bipartite graph, so what is this complete bipartite graph and what is this isomorphic graph, when the graph are said to be isomorphic. These terms we have already studied, right? so, so based on these terms with some examples based on these terms, that is complete graph, bipartite graph, isomorphic graph, there is a planar graph, reverse theorem, right? So the first question, find the weather complete graph K6, K6 and a complete bipartite graph K3, 3 are isomorphic or not. So, so we know the isomorphic, what is the isomorphic? In isomorphic, Number of vertices are same, number of edges are same, right? Then a degrees, right? So degrees, whatever vertices of n degrees are present in one graph. So same condition must be present in a, another graph. Also. So adjacency also preserved. Then and then only we can say that two, two graphs are said to be an isomorphic. So for these questions, the complete graph K6, right? So K6, right? So number of vertices for complete graph K6 are 6, we know, right? So number of vertices for K, that's complete bipartite graph, K3, 3. So how many vertices? That is 3 plus 3, that is M plus N, right? That is equal to 6, 3 plus 3, 6. So number of vertices are same. For complete graph, Number of edges, right? So number of edges is equal to n in bracket n minus one divided by two. So six into six minus one divided by two. So thirty by two that is equal to fifty. For complete bipartite graph, number of edges are this m into n, m into n. So three into three nine. So a number of edges are nine. For com for complete graph, number of edges are fifty. Means for this example, right, so it's a complete graph K6 and complete bipartite graph K3, 3, right, here number of edges are not same, here number of edges are not same, so you can say that these two graphs are not isomorphic to each other, isomorphic to each other. So again, another example based on the planar graph. So connected planar graph has a nine vertices having degree two comma two comma two comma three three four four and five right so there are nine vertices and whose degrees are given right so first question is how many edges are there and how many faces are there? so how many edges we have to find out and how many faces we sort of here we have to find out the how many regions are there so here n equal to 9, right? So whenever there are uh, degrees are given for the vertices, so we know the uh, there is handshaking lemma or handshaking theorem, the summation of degree of all the vertices is equal to twice the number of edges, right? So in, we use this handshaking lemma here, that is summation i is equal to 1 to n, the summation of degree of all the vertices, the degree of phi i is equal to twice the e. So number of vertices are nine. So just summation is addition of this addition of degree of all nine vertices. That is two plus two plus two, three plus three plus four plus four plus five. So that is equal to twice e. So this is equal to twenty five is equal to twice e. So e is equal to twenty five by two. Twenty five by two. And Euler's formula. So what is this Euler's formula? Euler's formula. Here, 
for second question we have to find out the how many faces are there how many faces means or how many regions are there so for regions we know the euler's formula that is v minus e plus r is equal to 2 so number of vertices are 9 number of edges approximately number of edges are 12 right so e is equal to e is equal to 25 by 2 that is is equal to 12 so 9 minus 12 plus r is equal to 2 so r equal to 2 plus 12 minus 9 is r equal to 5 so number of regions are number of regions are 5 so we stop here